at the end of the day, it's 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 American clothing. I, I don't. It's, it's sometimes hard to put into words, but you know, it, it sort of starts from that base and it ends up there. Typically, the, for me, the collection starts in, from a very sort of classic base. I like taking the you know, the classic, the preppy, and mixing it with uh, more of a workwear denim L. If you take those two things, put them together, that's usually where we end up somewhere in between or mashed together. It's sort of taking the hand-tailored suiting and then we make all of our outerwear on, on denim equipment. So it's typically a sturdier fabric that sort of ages well. So I, taking those things is what sort of the end result is. We uh, hand make all of our shoes um, in Italy. We primarily use cordovan. It's like the way it ages. It's a little tougher uh, material. Kind of matches up great with the um, with the outerwear. With the shoes and the boots, I've always. I mean, we always say it's it's it looks great now, but it's really what it looks like in six months after you beat the hell out of it. We sort of make things that we want to wear and our friends want to wear. might have a, a three-piece suit, but yeah, there's a, a busted out pair of chinos as well, so stuff you can, you know, get some use of. It. Our studio's in Florence, Alabama, but we spend a lot of time in New York, our shop and offices here on Bond Street, so I like things that you can wear in both places. Well, you know, the same piece can be great on a hunting trip, or it can be great, you know, walking through the village, and you feel comfortable in it, serves its purpose. Especially in the outerwear, I like to put, um, when we do do a jacket that has more of a, a game-inspired piece, really like to put all the functional things in it, where if you did want to take it bird hunting, it's going to hold up and have all those aspects that make it right. You know, we have our own shops, and um, so we see a, a wide variety of, of guys coming in from 20, year, you know, 20, 21 year old college kids coming in to you know 55 year old men coming in. Sometimes they're buying totally different things and what's, what's even more odd, sometimes they're buying the same thing. It's neat to see that reaction.